VR as an industry on the whole, there's so many hard problems yet to be solved. It really is just an open book for research and science for years to come. It's kind of like cars 100 years ago compared to cars of today. That whole time there's been massive innovation. So maybe in 100 years, I won't want to be working on virtual reality because it'll we'll have it perfect. But until we get there, it's going to be a very exciting, really fast moving field. Yeah, I doubt Palmer will ever get out of virtual reality. I'll probably die first. <laughs> That's probably true. Right now the community is taking off, it's exploding, and we're all on this mission to transform gaming, entertainment, the way we interact with one another. Everybody's part of the revolution. It's the most exciting thing in technology. There's no other place which lets you create new worlds. I've been working on a lot of research problems in academia, tracking and object recognition for many years. But VR is pretty much the first time we really have a good reason to solve all these problems. It's probably one of the most interesting fields in technology right now. And I think as designers, you really want to be on the kind of cutting edge of where things are happening. It's not often you get to define a grammar for something new. Well, I think in, in many ways, those obstacles are what's fun about developing for VR right now. I love being in a new space and it's just a new medium. It's fun to explore. I want to be there. I want to be there day one. I want to be part of that. Different people are going to pull different bits of magic out of this, and that brightens my day when I see a new application that does something novel or clever, and I think that was made possible by this. This is great, and I'm so happy I'm working on this. I am very excited to be a part of something that is going to change the world, and I do believe that. What really kind of impacts me about what we're doing here is how hard it would be for me to go back to making regular games. It's not possible. It's amazing, amazing progress in crazy directions all over the place, but all really funneling towards this idea of consumer VR. So I actually think that VR is maybe the most transformational technology of my lifetime. With every new technology, there are those people who see that it could possibly change the world, and that's who I think we have here today. This isn't a team of 10 or 100. This is a team of over 100,000 people coming together to realize the dream of virtual reality. I think we're all incredibly grateful for the impact the community's had on both Oculus and the Rift. They're really committed to getting this right, which is something we really believe in too. And it's amazing to have been on this journey with all of these people, making virtual reality what it is today. And I know I say this all the time, but really, we're just getting started.